Jai C. Aram. Welcome back to the channel. Today is all about discovering the hidden treasures right at our doorstep. We found a sweet spot to crash, and now, it's time to explore what this incredible place has to offer around us. So, let's dive in. As we step out, the vibe of this place is just amazing. The locals are friendly, and there's a charm in the air. We're not just tourists, we're becoming temporary locals. Just look at this. The towering trees on either side of the road create a natural canopy, and the air is filled with the earthy scent of the forest. It's moments like these that make you truly appreciate the wonders of our planet. These are cardamom plantations of local farmers. So beautiful! We also found a quaint little shop on our way which had mostly local products. So, in case if you need something you can give it a try. As we venture deeper into this enchanting forest, I can't help but feel a sense of awe and, I'll admit, a touch of trepidation. The silence is almost deafening, broken only by the sounds of nature. It's as if the forest is holding its breath, and we're intruders in its peaceful haven. However, as we proceed, the silence becomes almost overwhelming. It's like the forest has wrapped us in a blanket of tranquility. I won't lie, it's a bit eerie. I have heard stories of encounters with rogue elephant in such forests. But just when the quiet starts to play tricks on our minds, we spot a few vehicles in the distance. Seeing those vehicles and realizing we're not alone out here brings a sense of reassurance. The locals navigating these narrow paths are a testament to the harmony between humans and nature in this area. With newfound strength, we press on, eager to uncover more of the hidden wonders that await. The forest may be silent, but it's not empty. It's filled with life, stories, and the resilience of the locals who call this place home. As we delve deeper into the heart of this enchanted forest, the scenery becomes even more mesmerizing. The thick moss-covered trees speak volumes about the abundant rainfall this region receives. Let's venture further and see what secrets lie within this lush green wonderland. Just look at these trees! The moss hanging from their branches adds an ethereal touch to the surroundings. It's a clear sign of the generous rainfall this area receives, nurturing the vibrant ecosystem we're lucky enough to witness today. we navigate through this dense forest, we notice these narrow, unpaved paths leading deeper into the wilderness. These are likely the trails used by locals to access their plantations. Let's take a moment to appreciate the simplicity and harmony between the community and nature. This is more than just a road, it's a journey into the heart of nature. The paths leading into the forest are like gateways to hidden realms, inviting us to explore the unknown. It's moments like these that make travel so enriching, don't you think? Our journey through the mystical forest is gradually coming to an end. 
The towering trees are giving way to a more open landscape, and we are reaching to the merging point with the highway. As we bid farewell to the enchanting forest, a grand spectacle awaits us at the exit. The mountains that stood as silent guardians throughout our journey now create a breathtaking motion parallax effect as we merge onto the highway. Get ready for an awe-inspiring sight! Here it is, the grand exit. It's the mesmerizing motion parallax effect in action. Take a moment with me to appreciate this incredible sight. The mountains, the highway, and the clear sky above create a harmonious symphony of natural wonders. It's a visual treat that words can hardly capture. What unfolds before your eyes is a mountain range nestled within the Aduki Reserve Forest, serving as the natural border between the states of Kerala and Tamil Nadu. Further ahead, We'll be exploring Kalakumalai, with Bose Peak on the left and the hidden Misipulimala Peak behind it, offering a captivating panorama. Its unique topography, resembling a bowl or, perhaps, a cup of tea plantations, creates a microclimate essential for thriving tea plantations. This explains the common site of tea estates arranged in bowl-like formations, embraced by the Western Ghats ranges. Notably, there's the renowned village of Kuranjani beyond these ranges in Tamil Nadu, a must-visit destination for trekking enthusiasts. Moreover, the tea plantation in front is the Periyakonal Tea Estate, owned by the Tata Group. They have a sales outlet if you're interested in purchasing tea directly. You have the option to descend and explore the tea estate at your leisure. However, I won't be doing so now, as we plan to feature another tea estate in an upcoming episode soon. noting that the enchanting Chinna Canal waterfall likely originates from this same mountain range. Chinna Canal, the village right in front of us, adds to the picturesque scenery. From the mountain peaks, the surrounding area is aptly referred to as Surianelli, creating a seamless blend of natural wonders and cultural richness. We are glad that we decided to explore our locality otherwise we could have missed this, that's why sometimes it's better to take the road less traveled. Hope you're loving the series, 
I'd love to hear your thoughts in the comments. See you in the next episode of the series.